Hi, I'm Renee Parry, the Head of Property Management, and with me today is Amelia Hubbard, our Business Development Officer, and we're bringing to you the rental update for July 2017. We're excited to take you through 20 Verdon Street, one of our available properties for rent. Comprising of an open plan living kitchen with the warmth of a reverse cycle heat pump, the kitchen has all the mod cons and comes with a dishwasher. There are three bedrooms, two with built-ins and the main with a walk-in robe and its own personal ensuite. The main bedroom has a bath and shower as well as the convenience of a separate toilet. The lock-up garage and laundry has internal access for the ease of those rainy days. The yard is low maintenance with secure fencing. Located within walking distance to public schools, shops, public transport and the Maritime College and the University of Tasmania. If you'd like to inspect today, call Parry Property. This month's investment opportunity is listed for sale with Ken Jones and it's number one of 56 Florida Crescent in Trevallon. It comprises of a large living, kitchen and dining space. The kitchen has a great functional design with plenty of storage and all the necessary appliances. The unit is heated by electric heating. Both bedrooms have built-in storage and the main bathroom offers a separate bath, shower and toilet and vanity. This property enjoys the added benefit of a separate laundry which leads out to a covered deck. The courtyard at the rear of the property is secure and low maintenance. There is a separate shed with a roller door, single garage and internal access and adequate parking for your motorhome or extra vehicles. We believe the following property would make a solid investment providing an approximate 5.2% yield. We understand when your property stands vacant for a certain period of time, your earnings can take a big hit. So how do you make your property stand out in a competitive market? Today, Amelia is going to bring to you some tips on how to make your property stand out from the pack. Tip number one, what tenants are looking for in the market? Tenants judge properties based on the size, the state of the kitchen and bathroom, air conditioning and heating, and storage options. It's possible to add or fix some of these things by renovating, but be aware of not to overcapitalize. Don't spend more on improvements than you can realistically recoup by asking a higher rental price. Tip number two is to maximize your floor plan. Obviously the number of rooms in a rental property is important. If your property has a potential, consider minor renovations to convert a large existing room into an additional bedroom. Not only will you open up your property to a bigger market, you can expect a higher rental rate too. Tip number three, add-ons to add value. If you can't add rooms, there are other ways to boost your market appeal. Tenants always value storage space. If you can, install built-in wardrobes. That's an easy tick. Another wish list item is undercover parking. If you have a driveway, you can easily create a budget-friendly shelter with a shade sale. Energy efficient dishwashers, air conditioners and heat pumps all tick tenant boxes. If you can stretch to quality fittings and fixtures, you'll broaden your appeal to a desirable higher income market. Tip number four, a lick of paint works wonders. A paint job is magic for reviving and brightening tired interiors. Go with satin or semi-gloss to make scuffs and marks easier to deal with. And make sure you keep your colour scheme neutral. You want to appeal to the masses. You might think the lime green walls are the business, but a large percentage of the rental market won't share your enthusiasm. Tip number five, sweat the little things. Work on that curb appeal. The first impression potential tenants will get when they arrive for inspection. Clean the front entrance, mow the lawn, weed the garden and take out the rubbish. If there are broken windows, door handles or light fittings, fix or replace them. And clean, clean, clean. Kitchens and bathrooms sell properties, well in this case they rent properties, so make sure yours are impeccable. Scrub all surfaces and appliances and don't forget the fan and light fittings. Tip number six, get your team in place. To ensure you'll get your property in front of the greatest number of renters, find a good property manager. Don't skimp on professional photography. Without it, your place will appear pokey and we need it to appear like an enormous palace. Whatever the reality is, you want everyone in the market to inspect your property to maximise your chances of attracting the best tenant. Once you've got a good tenant, the best thing you can do to ensure steady returns on your investment is to keep them happy. Make sure your property manager knows that your goal is to keep your best tenants for the long term. 
Thanks again for tuning in today. If you'd like any more information on the state of the Launceston and the Launceston Greater Market, please phone our office today. Or if you have a property which is standing vacant currently and you would like some extra assistance or advice, please contact us ASAP 63 43 43 61.